Hi everyone, here's a question from exercise 1.4. Fourth question, the chapter is integer of class 7. The question is, write 5 pair of integers a, b such that a divided by b is equal to minus 3. One such pair is 6, minus 2 because 6 divided by minus 2 is minus 3. So here in place of a and b, a should be the greater number, uh, like a should be the dividend and b should be the divisor. And when you divide these two numbers, you should get minus 3. Okay, the 3 has a negative sign here. So to explain this, I have taken a 3 table here from 3 1s are 3 2, 3 10s are 30 because it's easy to pick the numbers here. Now here they have given the example of this number that is 2, uh, 6 divided by 2 is equal to 3. Now if you take any number from here like 9 divided by 3 will gonna give you 3, 12 divided by 4 will gonna give you 3, 18 divided by 6 will gonna give you 3. Okay, you can divide and check, you'll get the answer 3. So from the 3 table, you can take 5 pair, any 5 pair. And only thing is, you have to make sure about this sign. Because there's a 1 negative sign. You can put the negative sign either to the divider or like dividend or divisor. Any 1 number you have to choose and you have to put the negative sign. So we're going to pick from 5 pair from this. Like you can take 3 and 1. You can, sorry, not 3, this 3 and 1. You can take 9 and 3. You can take 21 and 7, anything. So I'm going to write down the numbers here. So here is the solution. So first pair I'm going to take is, I'm going to start with uh, 9 and 3. So it will be 9 comma 3. Or you can take negative sign to the any one of the numbers. So you can take 9, divide 9 and minus 3. Because 9 divided by minus 3 will going to give you minus 3. There's a one negative sign. So you in the final answer you're going to get a negative sign. The next I'm going to take here is 15 and 5. So the next pair is 15 and I'll take minus 5 because 15 divided by minus 5 is equal to minus 3. The next one we can take here 18 and 6. So I'll take here minus 18 and I'll take 6. You can just put negative sign to any one of the number because minus 18 divided by 6 is equal to minus 3. Then the next one, the next pair you can take here is 24 and 8. So you can take 20 minus 24 and 8 because 20 minus 24 divide by 8 is equal to minus 3 and the last one you can take here anything you just take 9 27 and 9 or 30 or 10 anything i'll take 30 and 10 so the last one is last pair is 30 and i'll take minus 10 so when you divide this two number that is 30 divided by minus 10 you'll get the answer minus 3 so this is very simple you can just choose any number from the three table and you'll get the answer in case you have further questions from this chapter or any other chapter, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.